Welcome to the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. I'm Meg Morrison. And I'm Mark Kennedy. Today we are at a course celebrating its 35th anniversary, the mature and always enjoyable Stony Plain Golf Course. This public 18-hole track is just 20 minutes west of Edmonton. It's the perfect spot for the entire family, even featuring a four-hole junior course that's free of charge. The Stony Plain Golf Course will challenge players of all skill levels and not break the bank. Our guest today is no stranger to the curling podium. She's a two-time Canadian University champion, a world junior silver medalist, and your reigning Canadian mixed doubles champion, Laura Walker. Laura Walker was Laura Crocker, for those of you who were confused when we first introduced you, and we've actually had your husband on the show as well. Yeah, I'm hoping to play a little better than he did today. Yeah, Jeff Walker, both curlers. He, he beat was, us. He did. You oh. guys must have a competitive family. I have big shoes to fill now. Yeah, you oh, do. Geez. I, do you golf, though? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, Jeff always says he has to play well to beat me, so we'll see. Ah, I like it. That's even better. Okay, we're uh, we're going to start it off with a pro tip. We'll head out to number 14 here at the Stony Plain Golf Course and meet up with executive professional Jeff Cuthbertson. He'll start us off there. The pro tip is brought to you by Cantorque, Canadian assembly tools built like Canada, beautiful, tough, designed to last. Today we're going to be doing a tip on lag putting. So guys, when you get on the green, you hit a good shot from the tee box, but you walk up and you're 25 or 30 feet from the hole. Lag putting is one of those shots that gives everybody a scare. A couple of things I like to look for when I'm lag putting. First thing, figure out how far it is to the hole. Second thing I like to look for, I'll stand behind and make sure I get an idea of whether the putt's gonna break left or right. Once I've got that figured out, then I start to take a couple of practice strokes, make sure I feel a distance. One of the biggest problems you'll see amateur players have with their putters is especially on leg putting, they like to use their hands and wrists. Instead, we want to focus on using our shoulders, trying to keep our hands nice and firm on the golf club without squeezing the heck out of it, but yet using our shoulders in a rocking motion. We want to make sure we're not popping our hands. Sound good? Sounds good, yeah. Show us the way. And you said 20 or 30 feet. You've got us at 52 well, feet. Well, we might be 50 feet here, yeah. so we'll see how this one goes. Okay. Sound good? Yep. All right. We're leaving the flag in not only for distance control, but also it's almost legal. Well, and that's going to be part of the new rules, Meg. You're going to be able to actually putt with the pin in, uh, no penalty. Um, so it's designed to hopefully help players play quicker, but also a little more enjoyment. Awesome. Yeah. Sorry, I'll stop getting in your kitchen here. I'll let you hit your putt. It's all right. You know I'm going to make this, right? Yeah, I know you are. That looks, oh, like looks good. good. That line looks good. Keep going. Get it towards the hole. So again, guys, we're trying to get it inside a circle. My idea when putts this length, if I can be inside three feet, I feel pretty comfortable that I should only two putt. You're lucky that you feel comfortable yeah. inside three feet. <laughs> How's your draw weight right now, Mark? On a golf course? Not very good. <laughs> Probably not on the curling rink either. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. This could be a little more of a take He's retired, draw. haven't you heard? Yeah. Well, no, he's not using that word. Semi. It's a, it's a step back. The break. Okay, stop. Oh, that has to go. It does have to go. It's a good line, though, Mark. Go, 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 go. Oh, that was Real a great line. line. Ooh, I'll take it. Hey, Pat. Ooh, Pat. I got that one in the forefoot. Funny's my nemesis. I did. Good one. Lots of curling references today. Yeah, I'll be lost. Okay. You a good putter? No. Oh. No, I don't think so. So this is a good tip for you, too? Yes. Okay. Just like drawn to the butt. Not good at that, either. <laughs> oh, good roll. That looks That's, like it's really good. It's got a good line, too. Yes. Oh, wow. You well done. I'll take it. Nice I wanted luck. to make sure I got it there. Yeah. Focus here. We're pretty close. This is a tight competition, guys. That's a good putt, too. That's a good roll, That's also. coming in there good. Look at this. Nice line. Wow. Oh, I'm going oh. to give Mark the line, too. Yes, you are. You're That's well the done, worst guys. place I could end up. But that was a great tip. We all executed not too bad. Yeah. That was very, very well done, guys. I was say, anytime you can get it inside that two to three foot circle on a leg putt, you're going on to the next hole, hopefully with just a two putt. So Perfect. very well done, guys. All right, well, we are going to take a quick break. We'll come back and finish off those putts. Hopefully they're all one putts. Here on the Pro-Arm Golf Show, brought to you by SLH. A fitness boutique where you focus on you. Yes, you can. Keep going here. You guys got this. No matter what age or fitness level, we offer modification to suit each client's needs. You can do it. Hang on to it. You're almost through it. Keep breathing. 
your time, your space, your studio. Tighten, lengthen, strengthen, unwind. You look beautiful. Hang on. Three, two, and release. Sculpt Fit, Bruce Grove. The Stony Plain Golf Course is celebrating 35 years with incredible deals. Seniors can play for $55 Monday through Thursday. That includes 18 holes and a shared cart. Enjoy date night on the Friday night, 9 and Dine. Only $45 gets you 9 holes with shared cart and a $20 food credit. Check out the new website to see all the deals, pro shop sales, rates, season events, and so much more. GolfStonelyPlain.com Welcome back to the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. We're here today at the Stony Plain Golf Course with reigning world mixed bronze medalist, Laura Crocker Walker. <laughs> had to throw that one in I there, had hey? To. Yeah. I had to. Not, I don't think I'm gonna hyphenate. It sounds cool, but that's, imagine my name is Laura Crocker Walker. How confusing is it now when you call people and it's like, oh, it's Laura Walker. I'm confusing myself. Yeah. Like I still call it Laura Crocker sometimes, sometimes Laura Walker. I have no idea, I'll get there. Was it a hard decision to take his last name? It was, yeah, like that's your name and especially being a curler, I've had a name on the back of my jersey for so many years and um, it, it's, it was tough, but at the end of the day, that's my family and I want the same last name as my family, so yeah. I'm gonna do it, but I, I hesitated a little bit. <laughs> Hesitantly. Now, it's an interesting story, though, because last year you, you play mixed doubles with your husband, Jeff. Yeah. But Jeff won the Briar, so he couldn't compete at the Canadian it's mixed fault. doubles. It's his fault. Yeah. So you kind of had to call around and see who would come play with you last minute, and you call Kirk Myers from mm -hmm. Saskatchewan. And what happened from there? Well, she's the best teammate ever, and we ended up uh, going on for quite the run at the Canadians, and um, won the Canadians, and then went to the World, so we were pretty new partners, but uh, he's in, Jeff's out. Like, you know this she, is like, televised. For, for now, oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Poor Jeff, I like Jeff. You know what, if he's a gonna- a great guest on the show, too. If he's gonna keep winning the Briar, that's his fault. As long as he's winning the Briar, I can't play with him as my partner, so. You know, you have a wonderful point. Yeah. And, well, I was going to say something, well, maybe he shouldn't win it, but if you were still in it, but. You're Jeff taking, beats me all the time. You're taking some time off. I'm taking some semi -retired. time Semi-retired. Semi-retired. Yeah. Yeah. Semi-retired. Semi-retired. Yeah, okay, well, let's get away from curling for a bit and see if we have any hands when it comes to three-footers, mm. four-footers, Yeah, where's footers. the tip for these putts? Yeah, that's what I need. Yeah, okay, well, let's get to it. Okay, what do you think the chances are of this going in? It looks pretty straight. It does, but you have to hit it straight for that to matter. True. Well, that was easy. Yeah, that was way too easy. Nice putt. Thank you. Okay, Mark, you and I have to make these. You go first. <laughs> Is she good at these? Well, usually we pick these up. Oh. <laughs> so uh, on the Just golf show, we usually don't have to or... make this. Yeah, exactly. Good putt. I was really grinding over that one. Two tie, all tie. I don't even have to putt. Yeah, I don't even know if we told you. This is three plays, three holes of match play, so it doesn't really matter what happens if it's tie. Okay, good yeah. to know. Yeah, to the okay. next one. Now well, you tell me the rules. Yeah. <laughs> For the next hole, we will be playing more golf, though, actually swinging a club and not just a putter. Before we play that, let's take a look at making the cut. It's brought to you by the ATB Classic, August 6th through 12th at the Country Hills Golf Club in Calgary. Fresh off a record-breaking 36 holes at the Paradise Canyon Open in Lethbridge, Zach Wright is finding his groove in the McKenzie Tour. He tore up the course at Paradise Canyon Golf Club, shooting 61 to put himself at 19 under par. He has been the most consistent golfer on the McKenzie Tour this season, leading the order of merit by posting top two, top six, and top two finishes through the first three events of the season. Watch for Zach this August at the ATB Classic at Country Hills. Cantorque is the fastest company in the bolting business. We power drivers in karting, Grand Am, NASCAR, and even run at over 385 kilometers per hour at the Indy 500. So you know we're fast. But we're not just fast, we're Canadian, and so are our tools. Made in Edmonton, we've taken everything Canadian. Beauty, durability, friendly and polite, and combined them all with our industry-leading speed. Find out more at Cantorque.com. Join Mark and me next May on the golf trip of a lifetime, conveniently planned just weeks prior to that same course 
being the host of the 2019 U.S. Open. You'll enjoy a chartered return flight direct from Edmonton to Monterey Airport in California. Three nights accommodation and three rounds of golf at three world-class golf courses. The hard part is done for you. Now all you have to do is commit. Visit ProAmGolfShow.ca for more details and to book your seat. A family-run business looking out for your best interest. That's what the Black Dirt Company has created. A business built on customer care, relationships, respect, and high performance. The Black Dirt Company will assist you and inspire you in the brand new Product Discovery Center. We know landscaping can be a lot of work. Let us carry the load. Visit us in Spruce Grove, south of the tracks. Our dirt is your dirt at blackdirtcompany.com. We're back at the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. We're here at the Stony Plain Golf Course with two-time Canadian University champion Laura Walker. And you are the third female in a row that we have had on the show. I know you're a player as well. We have been doing pretty well in yeah. the female department Blessed this year. Blessed with good female golfers. Yeah. And it's good for Mark because we're shorter usually. Yeah. We're used to having very tall guests. Yes, yes we are. And I, I usually rarely try get to, to look down. I, I don't usually fit. try to put Mark on yeah. a hill too, just because we're pretty close. I don't fit into the tall guest category. Yeah. I'm like gigantor today My driver next to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, it's time to play the second hole. We actually get to hit some shots here. We're starting with a tee shot. The second hole is brought to you by the Black Dirt Company. Create your backyard oasis. You pick up or they deliver. Mark, I have to compliment you on your style today. Because we match? You look good. Your shoes match your legs. Yeah. <laughs> Make shoes match your outfit. Your shoes match your legs. <laughs> we had enough white leg jokes this season. Never. I'm wearing pants next time. Maybe you invest in a spray tan. <laughs> oh, naturel. Oh, boom. That's my best drive on the show ever. Nice shot. Uh-oh. Get in the sand. Sit. Oh, oh, you're safe. I think it stopped. Is that like a green side bunker? It is. Crush it. Green. What a player. Someone's modest. You guys aren't safe there, I don't think. Oh, you yeah, never, we're You good. never know. Well, we've seen you swing. Okay. Don't be so humble. This is quite the forward tease. I think you can fly the green from here. I don't know about that. I'm 5'2", remember? Holy, you don't hit it like you're 5'2". <laughs> Good swing. Did I get see over that? those trees? Or? Yeah, you'll be over them. It might be hard for the cameras to see where you're at right now, but uh, Good shot. yeah, you'll be just in front of the green. Cool. Nicely done. Thanks. I don't complain very often. <laughs> oh, that's rich. I'm okay if you go to the forward tees, but this is a little bit crazy. Uh, it is a little But like you were too forward. good. You were both too good to be playing this far ahead. We don't make the rules. I, I started a new movement. Came up with this yesterday. We will not play the forward tees once women have equal pay. I'm with you, Meg. Once they do or until they do? Once they do, yeah. Or is that not the same thing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm confused. Getting analytical. It. I thought that was a great excuse, though. Oh, wow. She's way better than you, That's Mark. probably on the green, too. She is better. You totally outdrove me with yours. I just took a different angle at it. All right. Good drive. Three safe drives. Nice shot. It's a good morning on the Pro-Am Golf Show. Nice drive, Meg. Yeah, right in the middle of the fairway. More than we can say. Yeah, we're, we're roughing it. Oh, you get to practice your Country Hills tips. I do. Hands forward, don't break the wrists. Oh, that's got to go way further than that. Yikes. Ooh. That should be an easy putt from there. We just learned how to putt. I just feet. learned that, yeah. I've got this. Just put it within that circle. Easy par. This will test your soft skipping hands. Oh, what was that tip you just gave me? Uh, hands forward, don't break the wrists, or? Can't tell you. See you what here I can for do it, then. So. Good luck. Thanks, appreciate that. That looks good. Oh, Almost you got might hit with your divot. love that. Nice Get shot. Up there. That's stopped. I'm not used to that. That's a long way. Good shot. Thanks. You narrowly missed the bunker on that one. I did. I got lucky. Yeah, you even have not a bad stance here. This is a challenging shot. A little flop shot over the bunker. You got it. Over the bunkers. True. Oh, that looks good, Mark. Get up there. Well, it's ahead of oh. mine. <laughs> 
pass in my face. That's a bad shot. So Laura, you're uh, you're an Ontario girl. I am. So yeah. what made you decide to come out to Alberta? Originally it was curling. I moved out here uh, almost six years ago. I got a phone call from a coach out here who said, would you come out here for a year? And um, it was supposed to be for a year. <laughs> and I'm still here six years later. So I grew up in Toronto actually in the in the city and uh, now I'm Edmonton for good, I think. Good, yeah. we like that. Okay, so you've had a few different roles on the team. You were a skip, then you were a third, is that correct? Yeah. Now you've done the doubles. Yeah. And now you're going back to a skip, but you're going to th throw the third stone, right? No. On your oh. new team? I thought that that was the case for this year coming up. I just did that. Oh, you just did that? Yeah. Okay, so what's the plan for this year? That I'll just be a straight skip again. Okay. I'm can't sweep. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking like about a true too. Skip. Yeah, like if I curled, I wouldn't want to sweep. I figure I don't have to work out anymore now that I'm a skip, right? Is that how it works? You got, yeah, he doesn't that's know. how it works. I wouldn't know anymore. <laughs> yeah. You're semi-retired. Semi yeah. Yeah. yeah, but he was a third. So he doesn't know well, but if you have to work out to be a skip. Yeah. He doesn't know what it takes to be a skip. <laughs> What's happening here? <laughs> I love female shows. They're the best. <laughs> do you want to get back to putting? Yes. Do you like golf better I do than now. Yes. right now? Yes. Mark's yeah. not putting yet. Oh. <laughs> it just doesn't end. She's awesome. I'm out. Be nice to him on this shot. We won't say anything. Let him focus. Ooh. Sit. Maybe we shouldn't let him focus. Oh, jeez. Yes. Nice shot, Mark. Deal with that. <laughs> you really need to work on your cellies. He showed us. He did show you. <laughs> nice par, Mark. I just had this putt. I just had this putt. You can use your tip. Yeah. Just had some practice. Through the fringe. Oh, it's Turn. turning the wrong way on me. That's not a three-foot circle, but... No, it's close. more like a six-foot circle. It's not bad. I'm not quite as good at reading greens as I am at reading ice, so we'll see how this goes. Ice is flat. <laughs> not always, Meg. Pebbled, I guess. Oh, Ooh, that looks good. good. Okay. Ah, good par. I'm giving you that one. Yeah, that's a gimme. Thanks. So that means that we have another tie. Mm -hmm. A push going into the third and final hole. Good work, guys. It's getting exciting. This is getting exciting. This is going to be really intense going into the third hole. We'll take a quick break before we do that. This is the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH. Adjusting, improving, adapting, growing. SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving is ready to work with you. Since 1985, SLH has built a reputation for being tough enough to handle any job, just like the tough Albertans we work for. Oil field hauling, pile driving, crane and picker services, with branches in Slave Lake, Wabasca, Whitecourt, and Atchison. We've got you covered. Call today. Built to last. SLH. From a start of 22 carts in 1997 to becoming Western Canada's largest club car dealer, you know you're in good hands with the golf cart people. Whether it's on the course, at the lake, or just for the fun of it, the golf cart people are equipped to meet your needs. From sales, service, parts, customized accessories, and rentals, we'll suit you up with a new or used cart, or go the extra mile in a fully customized beauty sure to turn heads. The golf cart people, driving the future. A warm welcome awaits you at the Glenmore Inn and Convention Center. We take pride in offering guests a choice from 169 spacious guest rooms and suites with amenities to please business and leisure travelers alike. Enjoy the superb on-site dining at the Garden Court Buffet with a wide variety of delightful dishes. And with the ability to host 1,200 people, we are the perfect spot for your next event, big or small. The Glenmore Inn and Convention Center, offering superior customer service. Welcome back to the Pro-Am Golf Show, brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. We're here today at the Stony Plain Golf Course with reigning Canadian mixed doubles champion, Laura Crocker. Laura Walker. <laughs> Laura. Either one's yeah. fine, yeah. Sorry. That's okay. I wasn't even trying to make a joke there. <laughs> well, well, it makes sense though. So just to re-tee this up, 
That's a golf term as yeah, well. Good one. Uh, married to Jeff Walker now, also a curler, probably a very competitive household that you were in. A little bit. Yeah. yeah. And uh, after all the tips that you're getting today, you're probably going to kick his butt at golf. Yeah, too, I think right? we're going to play this weekend, and I'm looking forward to it. I'll report yeah. back on how it went, but I'm feeling pretty good about it. Wonderful. First two holes were a push. All comes down to the third and final hole. It's brought to you by Pro Star Energy, building cutting edge rig packages. We've played this hole a couple times over the years. Yeah. Don't be left. Or do. Oh, that wasn't pretty. But I might work. But it's gonna work. Ooh, that barely got off the ground. I feel like our cameraman Jason loved that one because it was so easy to find. Just a low Just a little screamer. screamer, yeah. Straight. Straight. Well, this is nice blue lightning in behind us. I picked this one. Yeah, you did. I like this one. The golf cart people delivered as soon as Mark requests something, it's like we have to do it. Drop everything. It's Mark Kennedy requesting it. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty fast. Yeah. Fastest golf cart I've been in a while. The way it should be, right? There's a good ball. Oh, are we good? Oh, look at the hang time. You pumped it. Yeah, I did. Nice ball. It's like Meg just learned how to golf for this season. It's amazing actually how well you can golf when you're not building a house at the same time. Focus. Last season that was the case. Meg's out there a ways. I know, and dead center of the fairway. Well, that's another good ball. Laura. Sorry, that was one of the best drives I hit in a really long time, actually. It's a bomb. I have an issue with you hitting it as far as me being like a foot shorter than me. I'm sorry. This is Jeff's old driver, so I think maybe it's that. It's like, got the extra distance or I don't know. You hit a really good ball. I'm impressed. Why did you have this so far away from the hole? You guys out drove me like 50 yards. Oops. Oops is right. Although you said you like this distance. I do. See how much you like it. Okay. Oh, turn a that little. Could catch the green still. Yes. Ooh, good shot. Just carry that bunker. Whew. That was, that was a lot a better than way. your tee shot. I didn't that hit my tee shot very far, did I? No. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't go back to curling ever. Go to golf? Yeah, yeah just go to golf. Professional golfer, Mark no, Kennedy. No, no, never mind, you're not there yet. What's your distance? I'm about 109 yards, so. Is that a good distance, or? I prefer 100. Oh. That would have been perfect, but we'll see. You're like me. 100's my favorite, but. That was well struck. Maybe too well struck. I clubbed up. You did. I shouldn't have. Ooh, good swing though. Yeah, Thanks. that was really good. Is this a dream distance for her? Does she have a dream distance? I don't know. Oof. Do ya? Does she? I don't know. I like a driver. That's about it. Knock her tight. Oh, that good looks swing. Good. I was expecting more fade on it. Stay right. Good shot. Oh, that's well short still. You get to practice your putting Leg tip again. Leg putts all day, all day. So Laura, you have a new team. I do have a new team, yeah. yeah. Who are you playing with and what's the plan? I'll um, be playing with a team of veterans, some really good uh, players with a lot of experience with Kathy Overton Clapham and uh, Lori Olson and Lainey Peters. So it'll be the four of us and I'll be skipping them. So I'm hoping to, not hoping to, I know I will learn a lot from them. Are you staying based out of Edmonton? Is your whole team around this area or do you have a we lot We have of one in stragglers? Edmonton, uh, one in Calgary and then one in Winnipeg. So we'll be playing out of Alberta and I'll have another teammate here with me in Edmonton and um, then get together whenever we can. So uh, do you guys have a four year plan? That's kind of the way curling goes nowadays. You put a team together to try to get to the next Olympics. Is that the, is that the major goal? Yeah, being the first year of a quadrennial and having it not um, as important as the following three years after that, we're just gonna play next year and then see how it goes. And um, maybe we'll keep playing and uh, we'll just take it one year at a time. I have a question that yes. uh, might make me sound stupid, but I don't know what that word is that you just said. <laughs> so it's an, <laughs> a quadrennial, yeah. an, an Olympic cycle. Okay, So gotcha. the start of, because we just had the Olympics, uh, this is the start of the next one. So it gets more and more important as you get closer and closer to the next Olympics. So right now we're as far away as we can be. So I'm just taking a year at a time. I've been in sports media for about like, I don't know, 12 years or so. So I figured if I don't know it, then there's other people that Probably. don't know it. So Good I point. was just helping everybody out at home. 
Thanks, yeah, man. You're Good welcome. job, Meg. Yeah. yeah. Now, you got to wear the maple leaf at the Worlds last year. How did that feel? And did that just push you to your drive and motivation even more to try to get to the Olympics? Yeah, it's, we live in Canada, as you know, as curlers, it's not every day that you get to wear a maple leaf on your back. So it was, um, it's been a while since I've done it too. So it was pretty special to put it back on again and then to win a medal. And um, yeah, there's not really any words to describe the feeling of competing for your country, but definitely increased our drive. Kirk and I are gonna try to play a little bit more mixed doubles next year so that we can um, hopefully defend our title and get back there again. That'd be a lot of fun. Awesome. Well, best of luck this season. I know it must be a little tough when you have three new players with you, but we'll be rooting for you. They're pretty good. I think we'll be good. Good. Thanks. Well, whoever makes one of these putts is going to win the show. So. It's got this a is pretty long putt. Long. Practice these, though. Ooh, that has to break. Turn. How does that not turn oh, more than your that? Speed was good. This yeah, is really that was a tough speed. putt. You know, if I have either weight or line, I'm good. And I had the weight on that one, so 50% accuracy. Yes. You were generous on that one. You gave me that putt. Mm-hmm. I gave it to you. Did you? I knew she wouldn't. So miss if it. I'm like close to that, then I'm good too. Is yes. that what you're saying? Okay. But we want you to sink this so that you have the win. I'm glad that we practiced long putts. We've had a few of them. It's the biggest shot of your life. Oh, you hit it there. Oh, oh, what a great putt. It's a little firm. It's okay, you gave it a go. We'll I'll give, give you that, you that one, too. one too. Yeah. Okay. Mark could sink this for the win now. Uh-oh. This is for the win? This is for the win. I really don't want to lose to Mark. You're going to. Uh-oh. This is going in. Uh-oh. Gotta get there. Oh, God, that looks good. Oh! <gasps> Still hasn't learned how to run. Not quite, no. Still runs yes. like a curler. Curlers don't really run. What is happening? Is this yourself? Oh. Yeah, I just won the golf show. I'm not high-fiving you. Oh, your face all red. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long run for him. He's retired. What a putt. You Good putt. Good putt, Mark. Good putt. Thanks. Oh, man, you win. <sighs> I did. The you worst win. part is that Jeff beat you and I didn't. Now I'm never going to hear the end <sighs> of this. That's right. Oh, that's true. Okay, You're welcome, there, Jeff. There's other things to be awarded. We've got the shot of the show. Slater, come on over here, buddy. Special guest for shot of the show happens to be my lovely nephew, Slater. Come on, stand right beside me, buddy. Okay, out of all those shots that you saw today, which one was the best? Mark the fruit shot. Yes. Mark the fruit shot. Mark wins everything today. Mark does win everything. Let's take a look at it now. Although you said you like this distance. I do. See how much you like it. Okay. Oh, turn a that little. Could catch the green still. Yes. Oh, shot. Just carry that bunker. Whew. Maybe you shouldn't go back to curling ever. Go to golf? Yeah, yeah. just go to golf. Professional golfer, Mark. No, Kennedy. no, never mind. You're not there yet. So Slater was brave on camera. Now Taves is in on it too. They both want to congratulate you guys on playing really well today. They have great hats. They do have great hats. Mark, do you feel bad about taking all the awards? These are not for me. Oh, okay. These are for you, Laura, for coming I on the show. I thought maybe they were for uh, Slater and Taves. No, these, no they're, they're even the combined, <laughs> their age isn't high enough yet. So on behalf of Dog Island Brewing, we've got some beer for you Thank there you. to That's enjoy awesome. in the off season. Also, on behalf of Century Vision, Karen Maui, Jim Sunglasses. I know you know Jeff got a pair last year. Now you guys can match. Jeff loves his sunglasses. Good. So I'm pretty pumped to have some too because he breaks with them all the time. Good. Go see Dr. Scott there and he'll Thank get you, you all suited up, okay? Perfect. Thanks. Thank you so much for coming on the show and uh, best of luck this season. We'll be watching. Thanks for having me. We want to thank the Stony Plain Golf Course for having us as well. We had a wonderful time out here. Thank you for watching. Keep in mind you can catch us every Sunday at 1230 right here on Global. If you miss any of our episodes, they're all online at proamgolfshow.ca. You can also follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at proamgolfshow. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Okay, Throat's well. getting a little scratchy. I'm just going <laughs> to That'll make bloopers. And when you're ready. <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's for the bloopers. This will come in handy. <laughs> oh, 17. 17. Excellent at Why that. Do you